Good Tuesday evening, everybody. Uh, pretty quiet here across our state. Going to be in a very nice night with clear skies and uh, some cool temperatures overnight. Uh, but uh, we could really see where that severe weather we had earlier this morning uh, went off to. It's uh, here in southern Minnesota into Wisconsin. Uh, there was a reported tornado in southern uh, Minnesota earlier today. Uh, they're kind of getting hammered down across uh, parts of the uh, northern Midwest there. Uh, our next system is going to come back off the uh, Canadian Rockies. This is what we're watching right now. And you can also already see uh, an area of low pressure kind of developing there with my little L arrow. Uh, it's also going to uh, drop a cold front. And uh, all of this is going to move our way over the next 24 hours or so, which means that we're going to see the chance for more thunderstorm development. Uh, by tomorrow afternoon. And yes, some of those storms could be on the strong to maybe severe side. In fact, the Storm Prediction Center does have a, uh, a marginal risk. I'll go ahead and uh, show that to you. It's going to be for southwest and south central North Dakota. Main threats for this will be uh, maybe some large hail and some strong winds. But uh, we do expect storms to maybe form by tomorrow afternoon. And uh, again, some of those could be strong so of course we'll watch but for tonight a quiet one out there with pretty uh, light winds clear skies and temperatures dropping into the 40s for some so it'll be on the cooler side for june highs tomorrow we're warming back up into the 70s and well into the 80s for some of us it's been a warm few days here in bismarck we'll see if we can climb back up well into the 80s again tomorrow but uh the threat for storms will keep temperatures a little cooler dick said steady temperatures highs there in the low 80s next few days Chances for thunderstorms tomorrow. And then maybe on Thursday, Williston, you're looking to stay mostly dry with plenty of sunshine, though. will be quite windy out there as well. We'll see strong westerly winds behind that cold front. And again, you're looking at windy conditions up towards Minot. Uh, Bismarck, you'll see a southerly wind for uh, the morning and into the afternoon. Winds will shift out of the west as that front comes in. And then also bring that chance for some stronger thunderstorms. So... Um, hold on. Looks like things are about to get a bit more active. We'll have more chances for thunderstorms on Thursday and then maybe a more widespread showers and thunderstorms, potentially stronger this weekend as a, a pretty significant storm system arrives out of the west. So we got that for you and uh, we'll see you at 10 o'clock tonight.